I feel like I linger Linger between the words to say eh? To say the words you remember Now we're here to take control Over your body and over your soul We're gonna take back everything and lose it all Lose it all
and welcome. Here we are at the Estadio El Sadar, a stadium named after a nearby river in Pamplona. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, at the microphone. And sitting alongside me is the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player, Stuart Robson. I'm looking forward to bringing you action from the Spanish top flight, La Liga. It's Osasuna against Girona. Can he make it count? There it is, the opening goal of this match. And what a start they've made. High quality defending. How can he take them on and beat them? He would be a bit annoyed to have lost the ball. And the referee allowing the game to flow, using advantage. Well, this looks really productive. What can they do from this position? That's a lovely ball. Making sure nothing came of it. My goodness, it looked as though he was clean through. And the referee, what will he do here? Very quick thinking there. Dovbik. Oh, it's a superb challenge. Very timely. Might work out. Timely intervention. And a creative look about this. He's in behind. Couldn't beat the keeper, unfortunately for him. Well, I think that's a bad miss. He just never looked convincing as he went through there. San Diego Albert. San Diego Albert. Possession changing hands. Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. Well, that's a foul, and it sets up a free kick in a dangerous position. And the free kick not far off at all. Well, that was struck so well. I actually think he'll be disappointed he didn't score there. That's how good a player he is. Barha. The attack continues, they're making considerable progress. Well, the goalkeeper making sure he avoided a mishap. Lucas Toro. Textbook defending inside the box. Making considerable progress with the ball. The crossbar got in the way. And a time for calm on the ball. Well, they're so unlucky not to be level now. It was a great effort. You just wonder if they're going to regret that. Well, they have to have that sense of self-belief. It could happen for them. Barha. Rewarded for that brilliant high press. Well, racing past his man. Well, half-time coming up shortly, and the home side on top. Stuart, interested to get your critique. Well, I think they've been the better side in this first half. They've defended well, they've looked dangerous in attack, and they've controlled the midfield. It's been a solid performance so far. Well, no point in stopping play. Advantage with them. Electing to cross into the centre. And a goal! The equaliser! Superb entertainment! So back underway, and an intriguing second half in prospect.
Ruben Pena. A very good tackle. A real opening now. And a goal! There he is, and the double. They just can't subdue him. Toro. Now with Baca. A move of promise on the flank. Oh, how about that for the last line of defence? Now breaking at pace. Potential danger. And the shot. Closing down well. And a throw in it's going to be. Herrera. And that's very intelligent play to win back possession. And quick thinking defensively. 30 minutes left for play. Superb looking pass. And danger averted. Well read. Now, what can they produce on the flank? A disappointing end to the move. Lucas Toro. That's a good pass. Can he finish this? And you just witnessed a moment of truly high-class goalkeeping. You're absolutely right. What a save that is. He's reacted so quickly. Artem Dogbik. Now counter-attacking possibilities. Oh, tight offside decision, but the flag does go up. 20 minutes to go. Really good build-up, but no end product. The referee knew that was foul play, but advantage it is. In with a chance. Well, the keeper reacted magnificently. Now, let's see what they can do here. It should be. And couldn't keep it underneath the crossbar. Well, he's close, but really from that sort of distance, he should be scoring. Lynch. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. Well, just listen to the atmosphere in here. The fans doing every bit to try and spur their team on for this equaliser. He could pick out a teammate. Now a good tackle. Well, no time to waste. Can they find an equaliser? This could square the game, but no, he's gone and missed it. Well, what a huge moment that could prove to be. They're running out of time here. Incisive pass. Well, somehow the goalkeeper got to it. Well, they'll be looking to add to their advantage from this corner. Ruben Peña. Well, the electronic board showing one additional minute. And there it is, the final whistle. Not what the home fans... It was a hard-fought contest, which neither side completely dominated, but the result will certainly hurt them. They need to bounce back next time out.
ready to commit themselves to excellence from 90 captivating. Hello from Catalonia. This is the scene here at this intimate venue, the Estadio de Montelivi. I'm Derek Ray at the microphone, and joining me for match commentary is Stuart Robson. An action coming up from the Spanish top division, La Liga. It is Girona facing Getafe. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play in a... Can he put it away? And the post getting in the way. There it is, the opening goal of this match, and what a start they've made. Well, very effective play in possession. Wanted to keep it, but couldn't. Oh, it was close, but he's put it over. Well, he knows that could prove to be a big miss. This game's not over yet. Forja Mayoral. Can he find the net? Save, but still a chance. Promising possession, this. He takes aim. Great defending. Good-looking move. Firing it in. And the keeper there to deal with it. Playing it in. Well, no danger now. Now they have possession in a good area of the pitch. Mayoral, oh, maybe the equaliser. Terrific piece of anticipation. I'll tell you what, that is really top-class defending. Intercepting it intelligently. Determined defending. in the center it did look on for them but not to be can they create something from here oh beating his opponent with ease real chance my goodness that save fully stretched he was one for his own highlights reel who can they pick out Alex Garcia. Viktor Tsigankov. Well, they've won themselves a corner and a chance perhaps to add an additional goal for security. As eyes for goal! And firing it towards goal on the volley. Could have gone in. Well, that's a big chance. Yes, it's on the volley, but I think he should score there. A very effective challenge put in. Opportunity here. And able to get a body in the way. Who's going to get on the end of it? Cleared away comprehensively. Shaping to shoot. And fired against the crossbar. Well, it looked as though it might be problematic for the keeper and the defenders, but they've got away with it. Well, he eventually clutches the ball, but they've got lucky here. That really looked like being a goal, didn't it? Chance for the leveller, and danger still. And in the end, no damage done. Pressure applied, can they make something of it? Artem Dovbik. Stuani! It's in! They're looking really relaxed and confident and not giving the opposition much of a look in. Well, there it is. Well, as they get the ball rolling again. Interesting to see how this second half pans out.
Porto. Christian Estuani. He's blocked it. And that's going to result in a goal kick. Diego Rico. And he has options available. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Marvellous anticipation. Well, the flag has gone up here. Offside it is. And Getafe with the ball again. Just knocked it out of there. Well, the attack carried promise, but petered out. Porto. The defenders, though, you can't really allow space like that. Can they convert? And thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. And over comes the corner. Clearance left a bit to be desired. Stopped a surefire goal. Can he convert? And the keeper more than equal to it. It will be a goal kick here. Well, it might not get his side back into this game, but I have to say, that was a top-class save. Fruitful-looking attack. Good weight on that pass. That is how to keep it out of the net. The referee spotted the little nick on the way through, so a throw-in coming up. And options in the centre. And a very good challenge. Jan Koto. Takes it on. Nicely blocked. 20 minutes to go. Not putting so much effort into winning back possession. Oh, big opportunity. And a goal. He's put it away. A celebratory moment. <laughs> On to Greenwood. Iglesias. A very effective challenge put in. A real opening now. That's useful play. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Mayoral, he's got to score! And there it is, a goal! But will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings? They haven't been at the best. Viktor Tsigankov. Christian Stuani. Well, catching it sweetly, but not quite the accuracy he was looking for. Well, it's always a difficult technique on the volley, but I think that's a massive chance he should score from. And he read it well, intercepting it. Now with Greenwood. And can they exploit the space out wide? And it's opening up. Artem Dovbik. Porto. And there it is, the final whistle. The home fans are going... In terms of possession and chances created, they were second best. But they kept plugging away and got a very good win in the end.
The build-up has been intense. Hello from the Catalan capital and one of the world's great cities, Barcelona. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position and alongside me is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player Stuart Robson. An action coming up from the Spanish top division, La Liga. It's Barcelona versus Getafe. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. Excellent defending. Well, this is what we think for Barcelona. Marc-André Ter Stegen starts in goal. Frenkie de Jong plays alongside Ilkay Gundogan in central midfield. And it's two strikers up front who will look to provide the goal-scoring threat. Can he finish? The initial 11 then for Hetafe. Well, they're using the same shape, so expect this to be a really tight game, which will be controlled by the team who win more of their individual battles. That's going to be the key today. Nice looking pass, and a chance for the lead. Tremendous defending to stonewall him. Promising move from Barcelona. Foiling his opponent completely. Eli Moriba. Well, if you're looking for somebody to change the course of a game, look no further than Rafinha. What might we see from him today? Well, if they get any free kicks around the edge of the penalty area today, Derek, he is so dangerous. I know he's a good all-round player, but his ability at set plays could be the deciding factor today in what could be a tight game. Huge block! Carmona. Well-timed tackle. Felix, can he take the chance? And up for grabs off the keeper. And he clears the danger. And they've given him too much space. Must take the lead here. Well, an opportunity here for them to get their noses in front from the corner. Could be! And he's missed the opportunity to net the opening goal. Well, it should be 1-0, Derek. You can see how frustrated he is with himself. Given away by Barcelona. What can they do from here? Oh, he's gone for goal! And a decent save, full credit. Ferran Torres. Araujo. Good-looking ball. Torres. Can he compose himself? Corner for Barcelona. But he's gone short with it. Well, this is a big moment, and don't these fans know it? Well, the danger is still there. And the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save. And short it is. Gundogan. Firing it towards goal. And what a magical save it was! And that's to go short. Gundogan. Oh, commanding goalkeeping. They'll repeat the trick. Corner again. And the short option preferred. De Jong. Oh, great block. Are they going to forge ahead? A gift for any goalkeeper. Borja Mayoral. And given away by Getafe. Well, the electronic board showing one additional minute. Moriba. Took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. And the whistle is sounded for... Well, they've got things going again here, and I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. Beautiful pass. Mayoral. That is a tackle and a half. 
Gundogan. You might say he'll be happy with some aspects of his performance so far, but not every aspect, Stuart. Yes, there's certainly room for improvement. He struggled to have any real impact on the game. He hasn't gotten the ball enough, and when he has, he's given it away cheaply. But I'm sure we'll see a marked improvement in the second half. Joao Felix. Now with De Jong. In it goes! The goal for 1-0, and that changes the dynamic. Carmona. Iglesias. Promising sequence. But timely defending when it mattered. Well, they're moving it around with real purpose here. Feeding it through. But how well he did to cut that one out. Lewandowski, and he takes it on! Oh, he's missed the chance to extend their advantage. Well, it was a decent effort, but not quite good enough to extend their lead. Perfect challenge. Lewandowski. And teammates around him. No way through. 20 minutes remaining. Moriba. Mayoral. Has a go. And danger still. It's got to be. And he's got a score to level us again. Torres. Just not looking confident in possession. Joao Felix. Oh, he's through here. Oh, that is a super save. Well, he had to finish that, but credit to the goalkeeper. That's a brilliant stop. That's what you call defending from the front. Possibilities here. Oh, a vital interception. Eli Moriba on to Rico. Well, you can see how fiercely they're concentrating on finding a winner. Thwarting him, and still an opportunity. Just can't get it past them. Well, how many times has he pulled off saves like that? At crucial times as well. What a keeper to Stegen is. Well, as spectacular as the save was, it can't be just about their stellar keeper. They know that. Credit to them for winning back possession. And that move comes to an end. Goal kick. And the advantage accrues to the attacking side. And just one minute of time added on for stoppages. And that is that. The 90 minutes have come and gone.
Hello, it's great to be with you, and our venue for this game is the Estadio El Sadar. I'm Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and alongside me at the microphone is Stuart Robson. And on the menu for you today, live action from La Liga EA Sports. It's Osasuna versus Barcelona. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, hitting the opposition back, playing the ball forward, and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. Lewandowski. Joao Felix. He's in behind. And collected tidily. He had plenty to think about. Well, this is what we think for Barcelona. Mark andre Ter Stegen starts in goal. Inigo Martinez plays with Andreas Christensen in central defence. Frenkie de Jong plays alongside Ilkay Gundogan in central midfield. And it's two strikers up front who will look to provide the goal-scoring threat. Now, who can he play it to? It's a Barcelona corner. And deciding to go short with this one. Torres. Martinez. And now was Joao Felix. Well, it didn't happen for them in attack. Kike Barha. And they did have the ball, but not anymore. Lewandowski angles it back Gundogan able to get his body in the way and cutting it out Aymar Oros plenty of support here Lucas Toro. Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. Took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. Barha. Had a chance to whip it in here. It's a perfect challenge. Decides to shoot and getting across to stop it well they've been frustrated for quite a while now but these fans have suddenly come to life couldn't grab hold of it well nothing comes of it oh tight offside decision but the flag does go up not advantage with them referee says play on it might be crucial intervention just then amid impending danger Gundogan Good tackle, take it away. Opportunity to deliver the cross. And he read it superbly. It's been threaded by Lewandowski. He's in position. And there it is, the breakthrough. That will do nicely. Well, couldn't quite find his teammate. Well, there it is, the first half. Of... Well, as they get the ball rolling again, interesting to see how the second half pans out. That's what you call defending from the front possibilities here. Not to be advised, giving the ball away there. And they've done it to square the game once again. Exhilarating. <laughs> Rafinha. Lewandowski.
chance to run at them crossed accurately towards the far post advantage Barcelona outdoing his opponent could be a chance to break here well a disappointing end to that break Barha and they couldn't quite muster a real threat Robert Lewandowski with an incisive pass Joao Felix oh a challenge that simply had to be won Trying to open them up. Such an important goalkeeping intervention under pressure. And the pass was just that little bit off. Nearly found its target. Lewandowski. Can he put them in front? Can he apply the finish? And the referee says corner kick. Gunduan. Bottom. And a penalty awarded. Spot kick coming up. This to see them take the lead once again. And the penalty is converted. A goal is his. And now he can exhale. Ruben Garcia. And he read it well, intercepting it. The fans are shouting, shoot! Big chance to get them on terms. Oh, there it is! A back and forth sort of match. Now they're level again. The lead lasted nearly minutes. Mojica. He's blocked it. Now we're inside the final 15 minutes. Oh, lovely ball. Well, they really had to be on their toes defensively, given the circumstances. Dangerous looking through ball. Well, he was being pressed, but did his job. Toro. Well, I have to say, these fans are doing everything to drive their team forward here. And support available. Barcelona on the front foot in anticipation of scoring the winner. Must take the lead here. And they do. And with so little time left, that will surely be decisive. Astonishing drama. Oros. They are making headway, but really they need a goal with time not on their side. Excellent block. Is it going to end up being productive for them? And it might be. And there it is. But hang on, the flag has gone up and it's not going to count. Well, it was a close call, but he is just offside. Good finish, mind you. So one minute of stoppage time. That's what the officials have said. Shot attempted. And the keeper more than equal to the task. Time really is of the essence. What can they do from this situation? Oh, a goal! That levels it in the closing phase of this game. And there's the whistle. They can't be separate.
time. Here we are at the Estadio de Montelivi. I'm Derek Ray, and keeping me company here on the commentary gantry is Stuart Robson. And what we have coming up for you is action from La Liga EA Sports. It is Girona versus Barcelona. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. And here's the Girona starting 11. Well, it's the basic 4-4-2 formation, but played well, it can... Great opportunity! And it's gone behind for the corner. Oh, last ditch defending at its very finest. Oh, he's lost possession of the ball. And still an opportunity. And held by the keeper at the second time of asking. Well, he's just pulled off a great first save there. Now they can all calm down. Oh, nice work to get past his opponent. Torres. He cuts it back. And a chance for the lead. Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. Barcelona now in potentially a dangerous position. Well, clearing it away, but at the expense of a corner. Keen to take it short here. Christensen. Still level here, but the pressure escalating. Joao Felix now mopping up defensively but he's gone short with it Robert Lewandowski waits at the back post oh yes what a classy goal and make no mistake there aren't many in the game who would have the confidence to even try it well he's gone back to give the free kick the referee here he tried to play advantage but it didn't accrue Herrera. In it goes to square the game. What a contest this is turning out to be. I couldn't quite find his teammate. Can they get in behind them? And power over subtlety. He's hit the woodwork. Well, he made decent contact with it, but he has to score from that range. De Jong Lewandowski can he get them in front and it's opening up oh good work by the keeper stopped a surefire goal space on the flank but nothing comes of it good defending it was Possession lost. Moving the ball forward with purpose. Must take the lead here. And they have. You've got to say, it has been coming. Given away by Barcelona. Getting forward. Can he take advantage? The game has been turned on its head. They have never stopped believing, and now they sense victory. One minute of stoppage time has been added on. And the referee... Well, they've got things going again here, and I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. Rafinha, is it going to be? Chance here, 
And it's a double for him in this game. No way for the opposition to contain him. And no wonder he's off celebrating. No let up on the pressing front. Artem Dovbik. It might be. And a goal to increase their advantage to two overall. That little bit of a cushion. Now it's all about keeping the concentration. It's a weighted pass. Well, that's going to go down as offside. Well, he couldn't quite release it quickly enough. And the flag went up. Flint. And that's an important intervention. Lewandowski. Can they get one back? And that's the hat-trick! Tearing apart this defence time and again. They simply can't handle him. So back underway here. And Barca within touching distance. It did look on for them, but not to be. The defenders know they need to get tighter, but nothing comes of it. Joao Felix. Now perhaps they can counter from here. Robert Lewandowski in the middle. Not all that convincing defensively. Oh, a brilliantly timed tackle when it really mattered. And space to exploit, maybe. Oh, that's a really good run. But Stamp defending what it mattered. Well, the attack looks promising. Well, it came to nothing in the end. De Jong. Joao Felix. Well, gifting away possession and room to roam for Barca on the wing beautiful pass De Jong and back to De Jong will they get themselves level here surely oh it's a really well timed challenge Felix, tremendously strong in the tackle. Just 10 minutes to go. Barcelona fighting against this overall situation. What can they pull out of the fire? That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Well, what an atmosphere we've got inside this stadium. The fans are driving the players on here. Surely they're going to hang on now. The free kick decision goes the way of Barcelona. Gundogan. Here's Rafinha. It's with Gundogan. Now he must favour the cross. He got in the way of that cross. Not a huge chunk of added time, one minute. Firing it in, and effectively parried away by the keeper. And there goes the final whistle. And they didn't dominate the game by any means today, but overall they had the better of the chances and just about deserved their win.
feel like I linger Linger between the words to say eh? To say the words you remember Now we're here to take control Over your body and over your soul We're gonna take back everything and lose it all Lose it all Coming to you today from the largest stadium in the Balearic Islands, the Visit Mallorca Estadi. I'm Derek Ray, and sitting next to me with his tactics charts at the ready is Stuart Robson. I'm looking forward to bringing you action from the Spanish top flight, La Liga. It's Mallorca up against Real Betis. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. Real chance. Well, somehow the goalkeeper got to it. And over it comes. Could still be dangerous. A oh, tremendous block. Not advantage with them. Referee says play on. And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. And a short corner, let's see. Still could put it away. Well, that is how to nullify the opposition. Well, you never quite know who's going to dominate a game in advance, but I think you can maybe make an argument for this fellow, Stuart. What do you think we'll see from him today? Well, Derek... Oh, hang on, Stuart. Big chance here. And the keeper really reacted brilliantly. Well, from that sort of range, it's a great save, I have to say. Kyle Larin. The referee correctly decided to play advantage. And Betty's doing well to regain possession. Oh, good looking run. Oh, a brilliantly timed tackle when it really mattered. Oh, that's a fine looking pass. Must be. Muriki.
I must say, this looks promising. Good through ball. And he did what he had to do defensively. And space for them here on the flank. A fine reading of the situation. And it's with Rodriguez. A very effective challenge put in. And teammates to play it to. Trying to open them up. Can he put them in front? Yes is the emphatic answer. And you have to say it was on the cards. Ezekiel Avila. Well, he's almost been hassled out of play here. Dani Rodriguez. Into the advanced position. This could level it. And it is the equaliser. Parity now. And who's to say what's going to happen next? Hector Villarín. Moving it forward. And space to cross it. Oh, what a clearance under pressure. Had to react and did. Will this corner bear fruit for them? Ambitious effort. Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. Well, another corner. Can they take advantage of this one? Oh, cleared away. Superb defending. Massive credit. And the sound of the heart. Into the second half then, and these two sides are locked together. Just can't really choose between them at the moment. Teammate available, and a penalty awarded. Spot kick coming up. To give them the lead here and confidently converted. Well, back underway as we reflect on the goal that's made it 2-1. Ezekiel Avila, determined defending. Illegal play, and hence a free kick. Well, now he's let that run out of play, and it will be a throw-in here. Oh, not a good throw-in at all. Advantage played. Well, he's gone back and awarded the free kick because there really wasn't much of a tangible advantage. Muriki able to skip past his man. And a very good challenge. Ezekiel Avila. Nicely cut out. So a half an hour remaining. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. Well, he's got plenty of space on the flank here. There's the cutback. Splendid defending. And the pass not quite accurate enough. And a throw in then. Really good interception. Well, the referee wasn't going to let that go. Muriki.
Costa. Excellent refereeing. Advantage in operation. Every pass hitting its target. Kyle Larin. Oh, surely! Full marks to the keeper. Well, what a reaction from the goalkeeper. Such a good save in the end. And into the last 15 minutes of action. Well, I don't think they've been at it today, but maybe, just maybe, that... And the referee has pointed to the spot. He's given the penalty. And now, let's see if they can level it up. And he slots it home with confidence. So, underway again at 2 all. Kyle Larin. And the search goes on for a winner. Time is tight. A very good tackle. That's a good-looking ball. The size to shoot. Oh, the post denied him. Well, that was so close, wasn't it? Will there be one more twist in the tail before the end? Let's hope so. Well, they have to have that sense of self-belief. It could happen for them. And cutting it out. Well, Betty's a bit sloppy in possession. Kyle Larin. And the decision offside here. Rodriguez. And one minute of stoppage time has been added on. A chance to whip it in. Can he put them in front? Stopped a surefire goal. Well, the outcome is a free kick here. And there's the whistle. They can't be separated. of you like a wave returns to the sea into the blue they change but in a cycle that I can lose each painful but delightful to live through you came into my life just like another season not for long, just a time Just like another season Maybe this time next year You'll reappear for no reason But I'll cherish every day Until you come my way this season Just like 
Welcome to the most vast stadium in Andalusia, the Estadio Benito Villa Marín here in Seville. I'm Derek Ray, and with me here on the commentary box is Stuart Robson. And the focus is on one of the finest leagues in world football, La Liga. It's Real Betis up against Real Sociedad. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? Genuine chance. In it goes. That will do nicely for starters. First goal of the game. And do they mean business on this occasion? Well, it didn't go as a plan in the end. Well, goal kick, just as it was looking promising. And just losing control of the ball, and it will be a throw-in. Bakombu. And intercepted it. Abi Galan. And passing it through. And that, a piece of goalkeeping, you're going to see again and again and again. Playing it in. And the danger is averted. Pressure exerted, but he keeps the ball. Well, sadly, they just couldn't keep possession. Bakambu. Well, it could be on for him here. And in, at the second time of asking, just what was required. <laughs> Moving the ball forward with purpose. Bryce Mendes, Umar Sadiq. Oh, that's a really good run. Now well, nothing comes of it. Oyar Sabal, Bryce Mendes. Can he put it in? William. Oh, could be. It's still alive. And 
problem solved for now. A very good tackle. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. Big chance to get them on terms. They just couldn't stay in front. And now this match is all square. Javi Galan. Showing a real will to win the ball. And they need to get tighter here. Opportunity it is. And a strong glove on the ball from the keeper. That was going in. He's got to score. Oh, he couldn't outwit the keeper. And there's the delivery. Not all that convincing defensively. Oh, that is a wonderful piece of challenging. And that's going to be all. Well, as they get the ball rolling again, interesting to see how the second half pans out. Making use of his physical strength to hang on to it. And a first half performance of genuine excellence from William Jose. Sum it up for us. Well, he was excellent in that first half. He almost ran the game at times with his passing ability. Unless he's marked better in the second period, he'll continue to dictate the flow of this match. Well, a really good run. Can they take the lead? A fantastic goal, and no wonder he's off celebrating. What can they do from here? This could be the equaliser. Frantic action from one end to the other. They weren't ahead for long. And this match is level again. Traore. Andre Silva with it. On to Avila. Bakambu. Well, a classic example of how to intercept. Oh, good run this now what can he do with it will it be and he's gone for power so close to finding the net William clean challenge a really good pass can't miss surely and in oh yes exactly what they were hoping to produce they've delivered the goal Umar Sadiq. Chance to do damage. Well, didn't go as a plan in the end. Ezekiel Avila. Oh, nice ball. Subimendi. Credit due, a good intervention. And out of play for what will be a Betis throw. And a chance to whip it in here. Well, just listen to this crowd. They want a bit more. They know there's still plenty of time to find an equaliser. Surely they get another chance. Maybe two. Oh, might be. And fired against the crossbar. This could square the game. Oh, a challenge of the highest order. Well, what a dramatic finish. How close was that? 
they should be able to hold on now with not much longer left. There might very well be late excitement. Five minutes left and the margin just one. Well, on the attack, hunting for a late equaliser here. Well, this could really help the cause. That is how to keep it out of the net. Takafusa Kubo. In possession, Mendes here. Oh, great vision. Oh, genuine chance. And a goal! They lead by two now. And that allows them to breathe a bit more easily. It looks promising. Can he make it count? Really good piece of goalkeeping there. And so the referee blows for full time and it goes down as a victory for the visitors. It's a comfortable win in the end. Fully deserved their victory because they dominated every aspect of the game. It was a really good result for them here today.
from one of the great venues in world football, the Estadio Santiago Bernabeu in Madrid. I'm Derek Ray, in position to bring you live match commentary, and my expert analyst, as always on these occasions, is Stuart Robson. An action coming up from the Spanish top division, La Liga. It's Real Madrid up against Real Sociedad. Well, thank well, if you're going to challenge like that, it has to be spot on. What do the referee think of it? Lenormand. Making sure it didn't get past him. Rodrigo. Chance to cross. Corner for Real Madrid. And short it is. Vinicius Jr. Spot on with that tackle. Andre Silva. Kubo. Andre Silva with it. Opportunity it is. And just like that, the break has stopped. Really top quality defending. And moving the ball forward with genuine purpose here. Well, it leads to the goal that puts them ahead. Goalkeeping of the highest order. Well, he's got to be pleased with that save. It's absolutely magnificent. And he's done well to tip it over the bar. Well, behind for another corner. Well, a bit short with the clearance. Real defensive resilience. Just can't get it past them. The defenders, no, you can't really allow space like that. Oh, good save. And over comes the corner. Still not clear. Well, it looks so threatening, but the danger averted. Oh, big chance. And he finds the net. He could hardly miss. Well, the action underway. Can Real find a response now? Federico Valverde. And he has options available. But they took care of the situation defensively. Jose Lu. Takafusa Kubo. Andres Silva. And they have possession again. Over the touchline for what will be a Real Madrid throw. And Real Sociedad did well to win the ball back. Sadiq. And he read it superbly. Valverde. And it might be. Well, how about that for a piece of tackling to break things up? Oyar Sabah. Promising pass. Just the challenge that was required. Oh, nice ball over the top. And a good take under duress there. Mikel Marino. Went in strongly, decisively. How can he take them on and beat them? Well, the cross goes in, but there's no one available to snap onto it. And the first half is in the history books. So the ball rolling again, second half underway. Will Real be able to up the game? Very quick thinking there. Just 
not looking confident in possession. You certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. Well, he's been the difference between the two sides, and not just because of his goal, but his general play has been really good. Maybe he could have been a bit more clinical in front of goal if I was being picky, but I wouldn't be surprised if he gets another in the second half. Same pair of hands did his job. Kubo. Subimendi. Our possession is the watchword inside their own territory. Good idea. Magnificent defending. Oh, you don't want to lose the ball in that position. Andres Silva. Will he play it in? Must score. Well, it might still work out for them. Well, it comes to nothing in the end. Given away by Real Madrid. Well, Real Sociedad have controlled the flow of the game in the last 15 minutes and have been threatening with it. Surely it's only a matter of time before they get another. Yes, it's so true. For once they find themselves in defensive mode. Dangerous looking through ball. And he's in the clear. Still a chance. Well, it's great when you can rely on your keeper. 20 minutes to go. And support available. And the flag has been raised here. Well, there can't have been a lot in that. Andres Silva. take it on well actually pretty easy for the goalkeeper in the end a matter of keeping his composure a magnificent stop well it should be a goal but take nothing away from the keeper that's a brilliant save Traore Andre Silva with it now can they hit them on the counter Andres Silva. And beyond the last defender, offside. Carvajal. There might very well be late excitement. Five minutes left, and the margin just one. Pulls it back. Great defending. Just the challenge that was required. Well, I think the fans are doing everything they can to get their team back into this. But can they find that moment of inspiration and get an equaliser? Takafusa Kubo. Oh, nice ball over the top to chase given him something to contemplate oh it's in and that might be the goal that clinches it for them no looking back now surely the final whistle and not to be for Real Madrid they have you're right Derek they really struggle to get to grips with the game they just a few mistakes at the back and it's cost them poor performance all round
the largest stadium in the Balearic Islands, the Visit Mallorca Estadi. My name is Derek Ray, and ready with his tactics board to provide all the analysis is Stuart Robson. An action coming up from the Spanish top division, La Liga. It's Mallorca taking on Real Madrid. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. Costa. It's with Larin. Samuel Costa. Committed challenge. And the starting players. Oh, they're in here, Derek. In it goes. An early goal. No wonder they're celebrating. Antonio Sanchez. And on the ball, Jaime Costa. Rayo. Molanes. And he takes on the shot. Well, no degree of difficulty for the goalkeeper. Nacho Fernandez. This is Kroos. And the pass deftly cut out. He has teammates around him. Oh, good skill, and he's managed to beat his man. Can he put it away? Oh, a challenge that simply had to be won. Kyle Larin. Jose Lu. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. He's got space. Well, that's how to do it. Has to score. Off the post and back in play. Well, no way through in the end. Well, they're so unlucky not to be level now. It was a great effort. You just wonder if they're going to regret that. Well, having been denied by the woodwork, now the focus is on keeping the opposition at bay. Kyle Larin. Costa and a tidy challenge. Nice weight on the pass. A strong hand on the ball. Given away by Real Madrid. Well, they're creating chances. They now just need to take one of them. Mind you, what a save that was. Pratt. and giving them too much space on the flank can he put it in and saved by the keeper cleared away winning it back high up the pitch interception to snuff out the danger Tony Kors So plenty of forward momentum from Real Madrid here. That's well blocked. Molanes. Kyle Larin. Can he convert? Save, but still a chance. Well, there we have it, the half-time whistle here in Mallorca. Away they go again, second half is underway here. Can he get the level? Oh, that's a fine save. And the referee says penalty. Chance to even things up here. Goal! Taking aim from the spot and finding the target. So underway. 
again here on the back of that leveller. Really inventive stuff from Real here. Spot on with that tackle. Antonio Sanchez. Very quick thinking there. Jose Lu. Molanes. And a decent delivery. A really good pass. Antonio Sanchez. Well, he was in the right place to intercept. And a tidy ball. Crossing opportunity. I'll tell you what, that is really top-class defending. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. Oh, great piece of individual skill. Carvajal. Oh, it comes to nothing in the end. Really should have made more of that. Molanes. Just 20 minutes remaining now. Dani Rodriguez. It's with Gonzalez. And a chance to whip it in here. Molanes. Good looking sequence this. They're eyeing that final pass you just feel. They're trying to take their time but not enough care on the ball. Sanchez. Goalkeeper's ball, and was always going to be. And take it away, he won the ball. Now we're inside the final ten minutes in this one. Distributing it well. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw-in. Well, just listen to the noise in here. These fans are doing everything to get their team over the finish line. And there's not long left now. What a good place to win it back. And let's see what it leads to. Rodrigo. And putting his body on the line. Of course. This could be the equaliser. How about this for drama? Costa Prats Well they're certainly thinking about a winner Plenty of players waiting in the middle Well they know how to pass the ball and at pace Shaping to shoot Magnificent defending there we have it, the 90 minutes are over.
Our camera lens trained on one man. Hello and welcome to the most vast stadium in Andalusia, the Estadio Benito Via Marin here in Seville. My name is Derek Ray and sitting next to me here on the commentary gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham United midfield man Stuart Robson. And is it going to be Jose Lu? And the penalty is given. The referee right on the spot and now a chance for them to take the lead here. And the keeper denies them from the spot. a good looking ball and he was being pressed but did his job Tony Kroos and Kroos failed to hold it good weight on that pass and behind it's gone for a corner can someone get on the end of this and a confident clearance and the ball is loose well it comes to nothing in the end Jose Lu Tony Kors a chance to whip it in well he stopped them in their tracks Good pressure to regain possession. Well, William has the ability to tantalise and terrorise opposing defences. Stewart, what might we see from him in this game? Well, Derek... Oh, Stewart, an opportunity! And a goal! Now they have their opener, and now they can celebrate! Are back underway, and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. Rodrigo oh good looking run oh could be and the keeper more than equal to it William now what can they do from here a fine reading of the situation to get tighter could be real chance and a goal it is for Real Madrid they are on a victory course Rodriguez and now Rodrigo oh he's left his marker for dead very alert defending to cut off the supply. William. Rodriguez. William. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. And denied by the keeper. Impressive. Well, they haven't seen too many chances, but the crowd sensing this could be a turning point. They need a goal here. Perfect tackle. Took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. Tony Kors. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Might work out. Well, when you're down by a couple of goals, you simply have to be opportunistic. Well, if they don't take those sort of chances, there's no way back for them here. And but... Away they go again. Second half is underway here. Vinicius Junior 
Vinicius Junior. Really good build up, but no end product. Vinicius Junior. And it's still on. And swiftly ending that attack. Well, the keeper had plenty to think about with bodies around him. And he keeps going. Oh, could, could get themselves back into it. It's got to be. And it goes to reduce the deficit. Still very much alive and kicking. Mark Rocca and teammates around him but quick thinking defensively thirty minutes to go then and it will be a free kick to Real Madrid Mendy Vinicius has been and getting in the way of that superb defensive play. Ezekiel Avila for attacking possibilities, but really sticking to the task defensively. Pablo Fornals. This could square the game, and that's exactly what has transpired. Now, that could be a massive turning point, and momentum is with them. Roselu. And that was a very fine read. Vinicius Jr. On to Rodrigo. Magnificent challenge to win it back. Willian. Vinicius Junior Rodrigo he could pick out a teammate Vinicius teamwork and passing in evidence opportunity to go ahead oh marvellous save great goalkeeping Willian not a promising looking attack but comes to nothing in the end <laughs> 10 minutes left for play still level Real Madrid continue to look for what could be a winner couldn't find a teammate throw in here well these players must be motivated the crowd have been great can they now get the winner a useful cross it's an opportunity oh a goal can you believe what we're watching it truly is a comeback and a half Mark Rocca oh it's a superb challenge but can he finish them off brilliantly blocked well, having been awarded the corner, they'll no doubt look to put the issue beyond all doubt. A high degree of difficulty with that sort of attempt. Well, he's just mistimed it, hasn't he? Didn't catch it how he would have wanted, and well, that's the result. And the referee brings this match to a close. Not. I thought it was a really intense game. Lots of quality, lots of good individual displays. In the end, though, they won't be happy with the defeat, nor the manner of it conceding so late on.
edition of Match Day and the. Welcome everyone on a perfect night for football with the floodlights beaming down. My name is Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry and sitting next to me, ready to give you all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. And the focus is very much on Serie A, the top division here in Italy. Stuart, your expectations? Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. Is it going to be? Oh, brilliant goalkeeping. Who's going to get on the end of it? Just the clearance that was needed. Oh, good strike. Oh, and it goes. Sensational strike. And now he deserves to celebrate. Bellanova. Getting forward. Ivan Ilic. Oh, a save right out of the top drawer. Superstop. And over comes the corner. Foul there. Free kick awarded. Gagliardini. And teammates around him. Tamez. Determined defending. Trying to open them up. Well, to think he only had the keeper to beat. Couldn't take the opportunity. Voivoda. Well, still searching for the equaliser, but not passing it anxiously. Duvan Zapata. And there the move ends for now. And the emphasis is on creativity. Well, very effective play in possession. What a corner kick it is. Let's see if they can put this to good use as they try to add to their advantage. Looking for someone to play it to. Terrific piece of anticipation. And the short option preferred. And whipped into the box. Well, nothing comes of it. Well, that's common sense refereeing to play advantage. Wasteful from Torino. Colombo. Can they convert? Oh, a vital piece of last-ditch defending. Well, the referee wasn't going to let that go. Good run, very much in control of the situation. And it wasn't a great pass, was it? So nearly at half-time, and the home side trailing, albeit not by much. Stuart, your thoughts up to this point? Well, it's been a tight first half so oh, far. Oh, Stuart, opportunity here. He got a good palm on it. Now they have possession in a good area of the pitch. Oh, a smart stop. Well, these fans have had to be patient. Could this be the equaliser? And that is not going to help the cause. The header well off the mark. Giorgios Kyriakopoulos. Zerbin. Well, high quality defending. Mergim Voivoda. The referee has decided there will be just one minute of added time. Can't miss, surely. My goodness, that save. Fully stretched he was. One for his own highlights reel. Can someone get on the end of this? And there it is, the half-time whistle. Well, underway once more, and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in this second half. Now, 
And support available. Went in strongly, decisively. And a lot to like about this attack. Surely the equaliser. He's got to score. Able to get his body in the way. Well, he's been the standout for his side so far, don't you think, Stuart? Life. And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. And he's fired over the corner. And a disappointing effort, making the keeper's life a bit too easy. Well, as you can see from the stats, their general play has been excellent. They've dominated the play, they've created chances, but the finishing has been really poor. And that has to change at some point. Well, controlling the ball again and hoping to make this count. Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. Fairly easy for the referee to spot that deflection. So now a throw in. And he read it well defensively. Chance to run at them. It needs an accurate cross. He knows he's got to react. Delightful pass. In goes the cross, but absolutely no support there. The high press was on, and the chance is on. And pure instinct from the keeper. Well, a top-class reaction from a top-class goalkeeper. Brilliant stuff. they create something from here opportunity and a goal to really bolster things for them two in front Samuele Ricci and a good looking ball cleared away comprehensively really good interception Ricci Adrian Tamez here. Can he get one back? He can! He's given his team a real opportunity. And momentum is with them. And the referee playing advantage. Churia. Just the challenge that was required. Well, still pushing forward. It's a matter of whether or not they can come up with an equaliser. Could be, oh, the goal! An equaliser in the closing stages! They've really got to give credit to the entire team because this was a bit like climbing Mount Everest. Might be able to produce from this position. On the attack, is there to be late excitement? Well, body in the way. And space to cross it. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. Tamez. Ricci. Well, the defenders know they need to get tighter. Can't really allow runs like that. And one minute of stoppage time has been added on. A really good pass. That is that after 90 minutes. They are level and extra time is coming up.
that truly deserves. Hello and a warm welcome on what is a glorious night for football. Perfect playing conditions. My name is Derek Ray and joining me for commentary is Stuart Robson. I'm greatly looking forward to bringing you live coverage of this match being played in Serie A. What do you anticipate seeing, Stuart? Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. This is the lineup for the home team. Well, it's the basic 4 4 2 formation, but played well, it can be really effective. And key to its success are the wide midfield players. They have to be fit, they need to be able to run with the ball, and they need to double up with their fullbacks. It's a really tough role for them. And a look at the lineup for Fiorentina. Well, on paper, it looks a rigid 4 4 2, but watch out for the rotation of the wide players and the forward runs from the central midfield players. They could be a handful today. Nzola. Well, they have it again. Very must take the lead here. Oh, he's been denied. And they remain locked together. Well, that's a good save, but really he should have scored from there. That's a big chance. And with that, the move comes to an end. And a goal kick to follow now. And he has options available. Determined defending. And a chance for them to nudge in front. In it goes! The opening goal in this contest. Alessio Zerbin. Plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce? Bonaventura. Kawame with it. Nzola. And a tidy tackle. And threading it through. Palmed away by the keeper. Ikone. Can he put it away? Vital intervention. Colombo. And a timely intervention. Bonaventura. Oh, that's a super piece of defending. Plenty of options. A smart stop here. The feed from Bonaventura. Well, he made great contact with that one, but the goalkeeper had his own ideas. Now they have possession in a good area of the pitch. Oh, tight offside decision, but the flag does go up. Antonin Barak. Well, can they exploit the space out wide? It might be. Just the challenge that was required. A chance then for the... So back underway here, into the second half. Cuts it back. Could pull one back here. And he does! He's thrown his team a lifeline. The belief is back. Bonaventura! There it is! Two to the good now, and that gives... 
gets them a buffer. We're getting the ball forward. Really fine piece of defending play to break us up. Zerbin. And he read it superbly. Antonin Barak. And on the ball, Ikone. He's got space. Ikone has a go. My goodness, that save. Fully stretched he was. One for his own highlights reel. Played over. Oh, he's gone for goal. Strong hand on that one. Well, Derek, this has been a really good performance, as you can see. They've created numerous chances, they're winning the game comfortably, and they could go on and score more. This could get really embarrassing. Is it going to end up being productive for them? And a goal! He's doubled his total for the day in superb scoring form! Mbala and Zola. And on the ball, Ikone. Nzola. Can he take the chance? It's a perfect challenge. Well, the fans are certainly playing their part. Here. Oh, wait a minute. They could well be in. The defender put in the challenge, and it might be a red card. Wasn't the best of free kicks. Surely the equaliser. And he's kept it out, fully stretched, somehow reaching it. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. And the defensive intervention there. Pessina, can they create something from here? Right, this could square the game. Oh, a challenge that simply had to be won. Bonaventura. Oh, that's an interesting pass. He's got to score. Oh, it's a superb challenge. Very timely. Oh, nice ball over the top. Danger averted. Ten minutes to go. Now, can they hit them on the counter? Under pressure. Doesn't seem to be bothering him. And scope for them to produce something exciting. The defender doing his job. Chasing this game, desperate for a leveller. But nothing comes of it. Ikone. So one minute of stoppage time, that's what the officials have said. And so, the final whistle here, the visitors come out on top, Stuart. Well, Derek, they...
The day is here. The match everyone... Hello and a warm welcome on what is a glorious night for football. Perfect playing conditions. I'm Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the technical and tactical analysis, is Stuart Robson. Oh, surely! And what a magical save it was! Short corner it is. Giorgio Scalvini. No way through! That's what you call defending from the front. Possibilities here. Good-looking move. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. And the referee allowing advantage to accrue to them. And this is how the hosts will begin the game today. Well, they're going to set up as a 4-4-2, which means the front two will need to be clever with their combination play. Dynamic with their movement and energetic with their closing down. I'm looking forward to seeing them play here today. And introducing the visitors' lineup today. Well, 4-4. Four, four. Could be... An early goal, it is the ideal opening. Nicolas Gonzalez. And here's Biragi. And credit due, a good intervention. Bonaventura here. Can he get them level? That was going in. Could be threatening. And there it is! Two goals in a matter of minutes. Incredible stuff. Christian Kouame. And given away by Fiorentina. Good use of advantage there. He'll have a go here. Well, the goalkeeper managed to make the save without much difficulty in the end. Decent looking pass. And both hands on it. Good goalkeeping. Lucas Martinez Cuarta. Antonin Barak. It's opening up for them. The delivery towards the back post. Appear to be in two minds. Well, they can keep possession of it now. Lookman. Bonaventura. And very nicely positioned to win it back. Muriel, great block. But he's gone short with it. Has eyes for goal. Well hit with power and almost the right precision. Bonaventura. And support available. Teammate available. Chance to get themselves back into it. Well, approaching half time on the home side, very much in charge here, Stuart. Your thoughts? Well, they're dominating this. Oh, game. they could be in here, Stuart. And you've just witnessed a moment of truly high class goalkeeping. You're absolutely right. What a save that is. He's reacted so quickly. Cup Mainers. Tremendously strong in the tackle. Lookman. Corner given. And short it is. Opportunity here. And the whistle is sounded for... So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. And the assistant referee has raised his flag offside. Clean challenge. 
trying his luck couldn't quite hang on and the keeper has it after that tension laden sequence well what a great first save that was how did he stop that well doesn't have to do it on his own well he read that brilliantly at the back attacking with vigor oh a vital interception Luis Muriel really good ball there might still be able to do a bit of damage well they can bring it out now Successfully cut out. Lookman. Must score! Well, the keeper has outdone himself. Wonderful save. Bonaventura. Really took a touch on the way out of play, so a throw in to come. And the right place to cut out the pass. Wasteful from Fiorentina. Distributing it well. Muriel! Oh, that is an outrageously good stop. Well, great reflexes from the keeper. He did brilliantly there. Well, those stats tell you everything. They're opening up the opposition at will, and while we've seen some really poor defending, their attacking play has been excellent. And Fiorentina have it back now. In behind for him to chase. But mistimed his run. Well, he's got the timing all wrong there. He just needs to bide his time. Rewarded for that brilliant high press. Ikone. Lookman. It's with Kopmainers. A chance for him to get in behind, maybe. And the flag has gone up here, offside the decision. Nzola. A bit of running room now on the wing. Ikone. That is how to keep it out of the net. Well, the seconds are ticking away, and the home side in control. Stuart, what have you made of this? Yeah, this has been a good performance. They've looked really sharp going forward, and they've shown a lot of energy. They'll certainly be pleased with their overall display up to now. Well, deciding to test the keeper, but no problems, really. Ikone. He's beaten his man. And space to cross it. Lookman. Still could put it away. Opportunity. Oh, that's an expert piece. And that is going to be that. Well, a tale of woe. And they weren't at their best today, both as individuals and as a team. And they didn't deserve anything from the game. Need a much better display next time out.
we got so intense to provide all the technical and tactical analysis is Stuart Robson and very much looking forward to bringing you action from Serie A. Stuart, tell us about your pre-match thoughts. Well, thanks Derek as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. Definitely look as though they want to make this move count. Tamez, well only just wide of the post. A look at the starting lineup for Torino. Well, 4 4 2 is a good formation if it's played well. It covers most of the bases defensively, and if you can then rotate your positions when you regain possession, you can also be fluid in attack. Let's hope we see that today. And the corner has been given. Cup Mainers. And here's Miranchuk.
Muriel. This is how the visitors will set up today. Well, in terms of shape, it's... Oh, very... they might score here, Stewart. An important challenge, but they must remain organised. Muriel. Well, he always seems to have that magic touch when it's required, Duban Zapata. Stuart, what do you expect to see from him today? Well, Derek, when he's on form, when he's focused... Can they forge ahead? They do! And you've got to say, they're good value for the lead. Lazaro. Samuele Ricci. Okereke. Moving it forward. He could pick out a teammate. And taking it away. Cop Mainers. A really good pass. Lazzaro. Samuele Ricci, untidy in possession. Delightful pass from a long way out. Well, it smacks into the gloves of the goalkeeper. Okereke. Raul Bellanova. Interception to snuff out the danger. Okereke. Distributing it well. He succeeds in clearing it. Fairly easy for the referee to spot that deflection. So now a throw in. Cop Mainers. Luis Muriel. Now look at this. They might be able to cash in here. Oh, big opportunity. It must go in, surely. And a goal. It was served up on a silver platter for him. Ricci. And you can sense the threat is there. Samuele Ricci. And the referee sees that as a foul. Free kick given. Skamaka. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Well, underway once more. And it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in the second half. And the cross goes in. Opportunity, maybe. Possession seeded by Torino. It might be. Just failing to hit the target. Good effort, though. Mergim Vojvoda. In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. And cutting it out. Luis Muriel. Could play it in. Really good build-up, but no end product. Raul Bellanova. Now options are plenty. Vlasic and deflected beyond the byline so a corner here well could this be the turning point the fans are certainly hoping so Skamaka no let up on the pressing front 
Oh, tremendous vision. Well, the keeper had plenty to think about with bodies around him. Lazzaro. Duvan Zapata. Perfectly positioned to take it away. Well, that one has promise. And scope for them to produce something exciting. But the danger averted for now. Great ball over the top. Long way out, this. And the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save. Well, they fancy a short one. Well, the defenders know they need to get tighter. Can't really allow runs like that. Tamez. Snuffing out the danger. Will he play it in? Under pressure. Well, I think you could call that an escape. It looked a certain goal. Every goalkeeper would expect to catch that one. Lazaro. Mergim Vojvoda. Well, there to intercept. Alexei Miranchuk. Here's Adamola Lukman. The cross is on. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. Difficult to stop him. Can he finish this? And a goal to put the final stamp on it. That will do it. Okereke. Well, not quite what he wanted to do with the pass. You can't really tackle like that and expect to get away with it. Booking to come, you would think. Oh, nice ball. Nice looking pass. Oh, good save. And just one minute of stoppage time, say the officials. And so the referee blows for full time and it goes down as a victory. They were the better team all over the pitch. We saw good individual performances. We saw an attack which was always threatening and they played really well. What a performance that was today.
one man the focus of attention. Well done. Hello and a warm welcome on what is a glorious night for football. Perfect playing conditions. I'm Derek Ray and keeping me company here on the commentary gantry is Stuart Robson. And very much looking forward to bringing you action from Serie A. What do you anticipate seeing, Stuart? Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and then... And the referee has pointed to the spot. A penalty it is and a chance for them to forge ahead. In it goes. Coley converted. Are back underway and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. It's there for him. Well, fantastic reflex action. Now, how about the short corner? What a shot from miles out and blocked. Read it superbly to take back possession. Good idea. Can he get them level? Well, body in the way. Really good diving stop to make sure the threat came to nothing. So the corner played into the box. Oh, tremendous reflex action there from the keeper. Well, he didn't have long to react, did he? But that's a top-class save, I have to say. Well, that's wonderful attacking play. Oh, commanding goalkeeping. Well, not cleared away completely. And gobbled up with ease by the keeper. Well, it wasn't first-class distribution. Giorgio Scalvini the referees letting it go as they keep the ball well that's how to do it inside your own penalty area Alessio Zerbin Cup Mainers. Fine build up as they look to add. Real chance. Pivotal moment defensively. This might be the perfect counter attacking opportunity. Oh, that's an interesting pass. Well, I must say, it did look so promising, but the flag is raised offside the verdict, Stuart. Well, he's just too eager there. It's the right run, but he's made it too early. Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. Skamaka. Well, that's a super ball over the top. Missing the target by a tiny margin. Well, it's a difficult skill to get right, but he almost pulled it off there. He made such good contact with the ball. Chance to attack using width. Can they square the game? A goal! Real excitement, a back-and-forth type of game. Now they're level. Well, it's a decent-looking attack, this. Lukman. Can he put them in front? It was on its way in. Colombo. If you're wondering about stoppage time, one minute to be added on. Well, a stylish moment to jump in front. Oh, not to be. Stopping a certain goal. So the whistle then, we're up the halfway stage. So back underway here, into the second half.
Well, possibilities in the centre. Oh, good defending to stop a decent-looking attack. Lukman. And now Muriel. Zabacosta. It's there for him. That was going in. Well, the keeper had plenty to think about with bodies around him. Pereira. And it's a quality pass. Well, he really read that brilliantly. We certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. Well, they weren't at their best, but with that equaliser, you can see why he's so important to this team. Hopefully they can get more of the ball to him in the second half so he can show us his ability. Lookman. Still looking to get the shot off. Possession changing hands. Well, a joy to watch. Cup Mainers. And good use of advantage. The referee allowing play to continue. Can they nudge in front? It has to be, surely. And the ball is loose. Cup Mainers. Chance, Luis Muriel. Can they stop it going in? And second time around, he scores. But the keeper left to wonder what his defenders were doing. A good vision there. And now their turn to have the ball. Alexei Miranchuk. A oh, nice ball over the top. Oh, might be. Oh, commanding goalkeeping. They favoured a short one here. Scalvini. Oh, nice ball. Well, goal kick, just as it was looking promising. Untidy in possession. Well, they're attacking, but time is the great enemy. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. Just ten minutes to go. Well, he's certainly not alone. Cuts it back. Alexei Miranchuk. Oh, lovely ball. And beyond the last defender, offside. Failed to keep hold of it. Well, this game will shortly be history, and the home side appear to be on the wrong end of the scoreline. Stuart, give us your take. Well, it's been close, but I'm not sure they deserve anything from this game. They've just not created enough clear-cut chances. There's still time, though. They just need to get the ball into the danger area. One minute of stoppage time has been added on. Muriel. On to Zabacosta. And so the referee blows for full time and it goes down as a victory for the visitors. Well...
And you can understand why. And hello from one of the great venues in world football, the San Siro in the city of Milan. I'm Derek Ray, and sitting next to me with his tactics charts at the ready is Stuart Robson. And the focus is very much on Serie A, the top division here in Italy. Stuart, tell us about your pre-match thoughts. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. Trying to deliver it accurately and stopping the danger. Good piece of closing down. Politano. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Juan Jesus. Good work from Milan to win it back. Giroud. Trying to open them up. Reading it well. Well, the threat was very real. Marvellous defending. Simeone. Well, over the top it goes. He didn't miss by an awful lot. Rafael Leao. Christian Pulisic has lost it. Decent looking pass. Giroud. And Pulisic has it. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. And space available inside. Is it going to be? Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. An example of how to press. We're getting right on top of their opponents and winning it back. Politano. Opportunity. Really sound defending. And the keeper really reacted brilliantly. Well, from that sort of range, it's a great save, I have to say. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. Well, a classic example of how to intercept. He continues his run, but nothing comes of it. And he's made headway. And there it is. 1-0. The efforts have been rewarded. And look at the celebrations. Giovanni Di Lorenzo Stanislav Lobotka Chance to equalise Oh, there it is! A back and forth on the match Now they're level again The lead lasted nearly minutes Given away by Milan Ozim Hen. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. A good vision there. Leal. Brilliantly blocked. Well, that's going to be all for the first half. 
So back underway and an intriguing second half in prospect. It's looking promising. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. Leal. Can he put them in front? And the goalkeeper will claim it. I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, he certainly got his team back into this game with that goal. It was up to that. Still alive. But it looks so threatening, but the danger averted. Good bit of closing down. Possession one. That's a lovely ball. He could pick out a teammate. Can he do it to take the lead? And in! Oh, yes! Exactly what they were hoping to produce. They've delivered the goal. Showing ambition to shoot from there. Goalkeeper has it. Well, the stats don't lie. Milan haven't created enough going forward. They've looked toothless at times. They need a big improvement here. And a goal! It's a finish of real class. No shortage of acrobatics on display here. He's judged it to perfection. Incredible header. And playing it through. Simeone. In it goes! He's made it a break. Stopping him apparently. Given away by the Rossoneri. Plenty of support here. Now, disappointing end to the move. This looks interesting. Giovanni Simeone. And the keeper more than equal to the task. Simeone that's a very fine piece of tackling 20 minutes to go in this one Ozim Hen he's given us away Rafael Leao Ozim Hen. Oh, genuine chance. And there is the goal to make it a hat trick. Excellent in finishing. There for all to see. Pulisic. Well, he could run onto it here. And opting for power over placement, but not the desired result. And foul it is then. And a bad pass it was. That's a good pass. Now was that the denial? of a clear goal-scoring opportunity. Just lacked a bit of conviction and straight into the wall. Now in a more than decent position. Five minutes to go. A really good pass. Chances on. A magnificent stop. Well, it should be a goal, but take nothing away from the keeper. That's a brilliant save. Now well, they might be able to launch a counter-attack. Distributing it well. Well, a disappointing end to that break. Well, just one minute of time added on for stoppages here. Rafael Leao. Might it be Olivier Giroud? And there goes the final whistle, a result Milan fans won.
probably the better team, but they didn't make the most of the chances they created and as a result ended up losing. It's disappointing for them really. and it's anyone welcome everyone on a perfect night for football with the floodlights beaming down i'm derek ray ready to bring you match commentary and alongside me is stuart robson and we're focusing on live action from italy's top division Serie A. what do you anticipate seeing stuart thanks derek as always this should be a good game great atmosphere inside the stadium we've got two teams full of quality some interesting matchups and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football what more could you ask for 
The lineup then for the hosts. Alex Moret is the goalkeeper. Giovanni Di Lorenzo plays with Mario Rui in the fullback positions. And the tactical configuration has two players in attack from the very outset. This is how the visitors will set up today. Well, 4 4 2 against 4 4 2. Could be! Well, given the position he found himself in, he really should be testing the keeper. Superb opportunity squandered. Karsdorf. Well, no let up, plenty of pressure. Well, if we're talking about players who could dominate, then we have to mention Matteo Politano. Stuart, what do you think we'll see from him in this game? Well, the best players are the ones that can play in tight areas, and he can certainly play in tight areas. Oh, the areas. chance is on, Stuart. Terrific piece of anticipation. And the defender coming out on top against Lukaku. Now, this looks really productive. What can they do from this position? But timely defending when it mattered. Brian Tristante. Romelu Lukaku now. Lukaku. With a textbook interception. Ozim Hen. Now Dendonka. Well, let's see about the cross. In position. And how about that for a save? Karsdorp. Romelu Lukaku now. Good tackle. Using his physical strength to make sure he doesn't lose the ball. Rui. Could take the lead. But it's great when you can rely on your keeper. Oh, sloppy passing. Crucial intervention just then amid impending danger. Well, they might be piling. Surely. Oh, keeper dealt with it. El Sharawi. Really good attacking play. He turns inside Dybala. What can he do? Brian Tristante. Decides to shoot. Up to it easily, the keeper. Well, this has to get better because, as those stats confirm, the attacking play from both sides just hasn't been good enough. It's all been a little bit too cautious so far. He takes aim. And still danger here. Threat over for now, it seems. Dybala, that was untidy. And that is going to be a free kick. He's gone and scores here, Romelu Lukaku. It's the first goal of this match. And to take it away. He has teammates around him. Simeone. Will he find the net? Frantic action from one end to the other. They weren't ahead for long. And this match is level again. Take some progress with the ball at his feet. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Well, they've got things going again here. And I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. Lukaku, it's with Dybala. Interception to snuff out the danger. Matero Politano, good play it in. Superbly read and executed. Well, an opportunity here for them to get their noses in front from the corner. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. In a decent position now. It should be! Well, what a stop it was! Well, I have to say, that's a magnificent save. That's a top-class piece of goalkeeping. Dybala. Karsdorp. Paolo Dybala can be a handful. 
He could pick out a teammate. Well, the cross came over, and a real need to get rid of the ball here. And foul it is then. Victor Ozimhen. Could still be dangerous. Well read to ease the pressure. Well, the supporters think it's on. Brilliantly blocked. Dybala. Here's Renato Sanchez. Brian Tristante. Rick Karsdorp. Pass and move, pass and move. Their opponents really struggling to get a look in. Matero Politano. Trying to open up the defence. Well, what a stop that was. Just have to make sure they don't get caught on the counter-attack. Can they keep it going? Teammate available. Oh, commanding goalkeeping. Dendonka. Andre Franck Zombo Anguissa. Well, these players must be motivated. The crowd have been great. Can they now get the winner? Oh, that's to put them ahead. And a goal! He's put it away. A celebratory moment. Christensen. Able to skip past his man. was a move of great promise they could easily have been in could be threatening and a really smart stop an important one to keep them in with a chance well that probably would have been it that's such a vital save from the keeper magnificent challenge can he finish them off we'll take efforts like that all day long Ndika still pressing for a goal here but the danger averted for now and we've entered the final five minutes might be able to get in behind the defense but well, there was impending danger but good defending Politano some of the fans are screaming have a go and still danger here and a goal it is, but offside is the verdict. Well, it's a good finish, but he was just offside. Great decision by the assistant. Well, the electronic board, and that is going to be that. Well, a 10. It's a hard court contest, which neither side completely dominated, but the result will certainly hurt them. They need to bounce back next time out.
Well, this is the kind of match every football fan... Hello and a warm welcome on what is a glorious night for football. Perfect playing conditions. I'm Derek Ray and my commentary partner here on the gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. And the focus is very much on Serie A, the top division here in Italy. In it goes! That will do nicely for starters. First goal of the game. Dybala really is obsessed with taking the game to the opposition. But can they produce from here? Yildiz. And great work to confuse the defender. El Sharawi. There to win it back. He'll try his luck here. Oh, a magnificent hit from there. And unfortunate to be denied by the woodwork. Well, good technique. He hit it with such power. And you're absolutely right. He's so unlucky. Dybala had to get that spot on and did fantastic challenge Locatelli the object of the exercise from Juventus is to get it forward that's what they're doing Dybala Lukaku and a goal Locatelli, Vlahovic, Rabio. Michele Di Giovanni è atteso alla biglietteria dello stadio. Lukaku, and a timely intervention. Chance to get themselves back into it. Well, the keeper had plenty to think about with bodies around him. Dybala. Oh, splendid skill. He takes aim. And he's gone for power. So close to finding the net. Oh, tremendous vision. Vlaovic. And teammates to play it to. And he favours the inside route. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. Well, not giving him any breathing room. And plenty of scope to be creative in that wide position. And up for grabs off the keeper. Terrific piece of anticipation. And Juve unable to keep the ball. What can they do from here? Car's door. And danger still. And offside. Lot to like about that pass. Lukaku. He could pick out a teammate. The timing was perfect. It had to be. Stop. and a useful cross and he knows he must dump it away and there goes the whistle bringing to it away they go again second half is underway here plenty of players waiting in the middle can he get one back and the referee has pointed to the spot. Penalty given. This to pull one back. And he puts it away confidently. So there we have it. 2-1. Karsdorp. 
Romelu Lukaku now. And nothing comes of that attack. The high press was on, and the chance is on. Plenty of support here. Good distribution. Can he put it away? Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. The delivery courtesy of Dybala. And a struggle to get it away properly. An alert piece of defending. Vlahovic. Rabio. Dusan Vlahovic. Now Rabio. Intercepting it intelligently. Well, that's one for them to pursue. In position now. El Sharawi. Lukaku. Oh, surely! Well, they've won themselves a corner and a chance perhaps to add an additional goal for security. And there's the delivery. And able to get a body in the way. Vlahovic. Bremer. Oh, he's given us away. Vlaovic. Can he open them up here? And a precise challenge just when it was required. Wonderfully weighted pass. Well, leaning back a bit. Couldn't keep the shot down. We're inside the final 15 minutes. Plenty of support here. Locatelli. Being pressed here. And they'll be a bit annoyed to have lost the ball. Oh, good strike! Can they nudge in front late on here? My goodness, that save. Fully stretched he was. One for his own highlight reel. Well, the two sides still locked together. And a set piece, a corner, can make... Look as though it might be the decisive goal, but the keeper had other ideas. Well, he's just saved his team here. What a reaction that is. Let's see about the delivery. Really smart stop, and no advantage for either side here. Now he's kept his team on level terms here. That was a really top-class save. Oh, they've done it! They forged ahead, and it might be the goal that gets the victory. Bremer. Now Rabio. Carlos Alcaraz. Oh, it comes to nothing in the end. Really should have made more of that. And we will have a couple of additional minutes at the end here. Rui Patricio. And that is the end of the game. It goes into the history. It was a really intense game. Lots of quality, lots of good individual displays. In the end, though, they won't be happy with the defeat, nor the manner of it conceding so late on.
can't run from what I feel inside and There's no more time to hide Because I, I feel again I, I feel again Oh now I, I feel again We're bringing this back to life Well, it is a stadium that absolutely oozes history. Here we are at the San Siro in Milan. I'm Derek Ray, your match commentator, and alongside providing all the tactical and technical analysis, it's Stuart Robson. And we're focusing on live action from Italy's top division, Serie A. It's Milan, and they take on Juventus. Can't miss, surely! Oh, did so well to deny him. And short it is. And no problems at all for the keeper. Okafor. And Milan's lineup looks like this. Mike Mignon begins in goal. Teo Hernandez starts with Davide Calabria in the fullback positions. And so many different ways to configure an attack. In this case, it'll be two men up front. And this is how Juventus will line up. Wojciech Szczesny is the goalkeeper. Adria Radio starts alongside Weston McKenney in central midfield. And the tactical configuration has two players in attack from the very outset. Oh, they're in here, Derek. And danger still. Oh, a really untidy loss of possession. Will it be? And then... Magnificent challenge to win it back. Can he put it in? Well blocked, but he must clear it away. And Milan have the ball once more. Juventus keep possession, and it's positive possession. What can they do from this position? Given away by Milan. Vlahovic. And teammates to play it to. Now, who can he pick out? Rabio. And it's with McKenney. Vlahovic. And a penalty it is. Well, when you're behind in the game, you certainly don't want to be conceding spot kicks. In it goes! Calmly conversion! 2 0 here, and the ball is moving again. Oh, what? 
what an opportunity. A goal! Just what they needed. Still plenty of life in this match. Well, the ball is rolling again, and Milan find themselves within touching distance here. Chukwese. Free kick awarded then by the referee. Hernandez. And very deftly cut out. Well, thumped clear. Dusan Vlahovic. Juventus, the old lady, they know how to keep the ball. What can they do from here? They'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. Quite possibly a yellow card as the flow was stopped. And it's gone out of play under real duress. That's useful play. Leao. Chukwese. Trying to craft something. Chance to finish. A pure instinct from the keeper. Well, a top-class reaction from a top-class goalkeeper. Brilliant stuff. And there we have it. Now the ball is rolling again. Second half underway. And as far as Milan are concerned, it's a matter of whether or not they can turn this around. Dusan Vlahovic. Keane. Juventus have given it away. You certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. Yeah, he's done okay in that first half. He's had a lot of the ball, he's used it well, and he's been energetic. But unfortunately, that can't be said about the rest of the team, who need to improve if they're going to turn this around. Benassa. There to win it back. It's opening up for them. Well, going for power and so close to finding the net. Well, good effect of pressure. And the ball back with Juve now. Benassa. Is this the moment? Oh, a goal! The equaliser! They completely changed the equation! And they give him back possession easily. Vlaovic to give them the advantage. And it's in! Can they create something from here? And lining it up. Spot on with that tackle. Rafael Leao. Happy to take on the shot. That is how to keep it out of the net. Into the final 20 minutes. Rafael Leao. Now Milan could be onto something. A good and fair challenge. A Juve free kick here. Well timed tackle. And he has options available. Rafael Leao. Fine work from Juve to win back possession. And passing it well.
Vraovic. Well, he stopped them in their tracks. Well, these Milan fans still believe they can get back into this, but they're going to have to throw everything at it now. Time is running out. It's a perfect challenge. It is advantage Juve, but no discernible advantage, and quite rightly, free kick awarded. And the flag raised, offside it is. Ball lost by Juventus. Yildiz. Well, what a dramatic finish we could have here. These Milan fans are ramping up the atmosphere now. So one minute of stoppage time, that's what the officials have said. Able to skip past his man. Well shown inside. Able to get his body in the way. And there goes the final whistle. A result Milan fan. It was a poor result. It was a really tight contest. Both sides had their chances. Could have gone either way. But in the end, they will be disappointed.
Stadium is buzzing already and with good well just the sort of weather the fans were hoping for this evening it's absolutely ideal I'm Derek Ray and I'm joined here on the gantry for commentary by Stuart Robson I'm greatly looking forward to bringing you live coverage of this match being played in Serie A Stuart how do you see this one going well Derek when looking forward to this game you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. And very nicely positioned to win it back. Ozim Hen. Could be. In it goes. An early goal. No wonder they're celebrating. They get the ball once more. This attack looks highly promising. Oh, great vision. He's gone and found the net. Brilliant piece of finishing. Magnificent goal. And danger averted. Well read. Yildiz. A foul, but no whistle. Instead, advantage Juventus. The referee spotted the infringement, and it will be a free kick in a position of genuine menace. And disappointingly, straight into the wall. Rabiot. Locatelli. Taking care of business defensively here. Stanislav Lobotka and Politano with it Lobotka back with Politano can he take the chance and it's in they're back in front stunning scenes here well that's a good looking position is there a goal in the future a wonderful intervention Yildiz might really be able to trouble them here they could level it and it goes to square the game what a contest this is turning out to be Ozim Hen well there was impending danger but good defending we're well, being pressed here Could be dangerous. And he did what he had to do defensively. Really good example of Gigan pressing. Vlaovic intercepting it intelligently. Simeone electing to shoot. Able to close down the shot. An opportunity to forge ahead from this corner situation. Not really the ideal clearance. Must take the lead here. Making sure nothing untoward happened. Superb tackle. Trying to open them up. Now, will they do it from here? Oh, the keeper made it look routine. It was anything but. Ongisa. Politano. Took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. Incisive pass. Oh, it was a crucial challenge. Being pressed hard.
Rabio. Vlaovic. Is this the moment? It's gone in! And well, he might celebrate on the back of that. And the whistle. Well, as they get the ball rolling again, interesting to see how this second half pans out. This could be the equaliser. Oh, but he's missed it. He's completely failed the test. Well, that was a big opportunity, and they really should be level now. They have to be more clinical in front of goal. Well, it really looked as though that was going to be another goal from him. Well, a chance for his second there. Probably should have done a bit better there, really. And nicely struck. But the keeper takes charge, and it was pretty straightforward. But it wasn't first-class distribution. Vraovic and blocked. Over the byline, hence a goal kick. This man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Stuart. Well, what a first half he had. I thought he was outstanding. He caused the defenders all sorts of problems with his movement and pace, and he fully deserved his two goals, and I expect more from him in the second half. And steered back under a bit of pressure. Boritano. Ozinhen. Simeone. And this to level it. He's blocked it. Danilo. It's with Milik. Oh, they've lost it. Well, the attacking options appear plentiful. Opportunity here. Oh, it was there for him. Well, it's not a good finish, is it? That was a glorious opportunity. Rabio. A Juve free kick here. Now the counter-attack looks on. And playing it through. And he's made it a brace for himself. The defender's just unable to stay with him. And he's having a field day. Milik. The verdict is offside here. Simeone. The fans want to see a shot. Well, somehow the goalkeeper got to it. Well, they haven't created too much lately, but the fans know this is a chance. They've only gone and grabbed another one. Two goals in quick succession. Now they have the lead. No wonder they're celebrating. They're getting the ball forward. And a confident clearance. Giovanni Di Lorenzo. And there to intervene. Making progress. Rabio. Locatelli. The referee spotted the infringement, and it will be a free kick in a position of genuine menace. No match for a well organized wall. Just 10 minutes remaining here. Well, just listen to the noise in here. These fans are doing everything to get their team over the finish line, and there's not long left now. Simeone, that's a good-looking ball. Can he finish this? And a fine piece of goalkeeping, which keeps their hopes alive. Well, you're right, that keeps them in it. But can they find an equaliser? They need some urgency in their play. A really good pass. There to win it back. Simeone. Locatelli with it. Juventus battling against the clock and the scoreline. What? Well, hit with ferocity when accuracy was required. And the electronic board delivers the news. Two minutes of stoppage time.
Ogisa using his body to good effect. And there it is, the final whistle, and the fans will be leaving the stadium with... It was very competitive. Chances at both ends, but I feel they were the better team, and they deserve their victory. And a warm welcome to Frankfurt, the home of the Deutsche Bank Park. My name is Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary by the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. And the focus is on the Bundesliga. Live action coming up. It's Eintracht Frankfurt up against Borussia Mönchengladbach. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, hitting the opposition back, playing the ball forward, and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. 
And here's the starting 11 for Borussia Mönchengladbach. Well, if they're going to play as a 4-4-2, they must make sure they stay compact out of possession and then stretch the pitch when they do have the ball. How they play in transition is going to be key today. Oh, they could put it away, Stewart. There it is, and just the ideal start. Nico Alvedi, they've given it away. And with that, they've thwarted the opportunity. And they might be through here. Frantic action from one end to the other. They weren't ahead for long. And this match is level again. Went in strongly, decisively. And a free kick awarded by the referee. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. In position, the game has been turned on its head. They have never stopped believing, and now they sense victory. Dina Ebambe. Well, she wanted to let the play flow, but in the end decided that that wasn't possible. The outcome is a goal kick here. Julian Weigel. Excellent refereeing, advantage in operation. Perfect challenge. And Gladbach will get the throw in. Gumu. Oh, surely. Oh, it's in. A two-goal cushion now. And the lead fully merited. Tuta. And a poor ball. Slice of pass, a matter of keeping his composure, and he's made it a brace for himself. The defenders just unable to stay with him, and he's having a field day. Dina Ebambe. Not made it look routine, but read it well. Elias Skiri. Eintracht Frankfurt sloppy in possession. Safe pair of hands did his job. Tuta. Ekitike. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Must score! And you cannot argue with a hat trick. Simply unstoppable today. Koch. Well, there it is. The first half. Well, underway once more. And it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in the second half. Moving forward effectively, but nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Robin Hack. Chances on. Still possibilities. Well, they can keep possession now. Failure to keep the ball by Eintracht. Well, that was incisive.
pivotal moment defensively. Elias Skiri. Well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter attack. Oh, breezing past him. And almost the ideal counter attack, but no reward in the end. Well, breathtaking football, but not the finish the match. Could be dangerous. Oh, but there's defensive diligence for you when things look dangerous. Hugo Ekitike. Ansgar Knauf. Able to clear the danger, at least for now. Robin Hack. Great ball over the top. He might be able to make it through. Oh, he did superbly well to get back there and thwart him. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Opportunity it is. Brilliant save. Really well positioned. This has been a top-class display today. Just look how many chances they've created. And if they want to, they could score a hatful of goals here. Eki Tike. And threading it through. A strong hand on the ball. Well, we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. In the right place to cut out the pass. That's a good-looking pass. And rattling the post. And problem solved for now. Rode. It's a perfect challenge. And a useful cross. Clears it away. Can he make it count? Denied by the bar. Back in play here. Well, able to survive that attacking push. Oh, good run, this. Now, what can he do with it? He must finish! Really good diving stop to make sure the threat came to nothing. Well, the stoppage time situation. One minute here. And that is the end of the game. It goes into the history books as a home defeat. The of the performance more than anything else. They never got out of second gear and were completely dominated all over the park. Tell you what, though, I wouldn't want to be in that dressing room right now.
future set and the prospect mouth-watering. Two teams at the peak of their powers, ready. We're at the Borussia Park in the city of München Gladbach, not too far from Germany's border with the Netherlands. I'm Derek Ray, and my commentary partner here on the gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. And the focus is on the Bundesliga. Live action coming up. What do you anticipate seeing, Stuart? Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. Could be! And a goal! Not bad for starters! They take an early lead! And he did well to cut it out. And a chance to whip it in here. This could level it. And it is the equaliser. Parity now. And who's to say what's going to happen next? Not a great pass. Doan. Great opportunity. Terrific block there. Just can't get it past them. Useful looking position, you've got to say. And they really had to be on their toes defensively, given the circumstances. Well, there's defensive solidity for you. Under real pressure here. Crucial piece of defending. Grifo. Teammates available. Grigoric! And a goal! There he is at the double. They just can't subdue him. Brühl. Will he play it in? Eggestein. The referee knew that was foul play, but after the foul, a chance to contemplate what is next and perhaps a goal from this free kick. Strong hand on that one. And this situation could be dangerous. Ginter. Rull. And this is Grifo. Well, really rifling that one in, and he didn't miss by much. Read it superbly to take back possession. And offside, unfortunately. That'll be Gladbach's ball. Top-class defending. Ritsu Doan. Now, let's see what they can do here. That's a useful cross. It's offside, unfortunately. Well, I understand he's eager to get on the end of the cross, but he must stay onside. See Batcher. Oh, that's an expert piece of defending. This could be the equaliser. Oh, a stellar piece of defending. So nearly at half time, and the home side trailing, albeit not by much. Stuart, your thoughts up to this point? Well, it's been a good game so far, and they've played a big part in that. But if they are to get back into this, they need to be. Oh, more... big chance here! Oh, my word! There's excellent timing for you. What a challenge! Can he deliver it with accuracy? And there goes the... 
Well, they've got things going again here, and I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. And a tidy challenge. Chance to equalise. And a goal! To level this contest! All even! Ritsu Doan. Lucas Hörner. Now he must favour the cross. But he knew he had to get to the ball, and he did. Can they forge ahead? They do! And you've got to say, the good value for the lead. Oh, nice work to get past his opponents. Will he finish? Oh, that surely had to go in, but marvellous defending. Well, he would love to have that header back. Ritsu Doan. Lucas Hörner. Really getting stuck in. Nathan Gumu. Robin Hack. Oh, he's lost possession. Can they convert? Well, what a stop it was. Well, I have to say, that's a magnificent save. That's a top-class piece of goalkeeping. And able to close down the shots. Chance for the leveller. A very timely interception. Well. On the ball, Sebatcher. Ginter. Not a great pass. Twenty minutes to go. Danger averted. Lucas Hörner. Röhl. Determined defending. Doan. Retaining possession proving difficult. Röhl. Gladbach recovering possession well. What was the chance they could get caught out on the break here? Late drama here. Level once more. Incredible scenes. Well, nicely cut out. Now what can they do with the ball? What to like about that pass? Well, you can see how fiercely they're concentrating on finding a winner. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. Well, it's been a frustrating day for these fans. They want a goal. They're urging them to attack now. Ritsu Doan. Röhl. Well, it could be on for him here. Well, the teams are level, and every corner counts at this juncture. Trying to deliver it accurately. Well, not away properly. And the whistle is sounded, and these two teams... Got another season.
keep on changing Just like another season And hello from the Heldenstadt, as it's known, the city of heroes. The venue is the Red Bull Arena. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry and delighted to be joined, as always, by Stuart Robson. And very much looking forward to bringing you live action from the Bundesliga in a matter of moments. What might we see today, Stuart? Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. They've lost it. It's got to be. There it is. The opening goal of this match. And what a start they've made. Grifo. Lucas Hörda. A delicious piece of skill. Well, danger averted thanks to his teammates. Well, good run and good ball control. Well, they have the ball once more. Incisive pass. Took a really smart piece of defending to stop them.
Paulsen. Schlager. Interception to snuff out the danger. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. Oh, what an opportunity. And not cleared away properly. Well, they survived the attack. Well, the outcome is a free kick here. Clean challenge. And will it be the leveller? The save was a good one. And over it comes. Oh, so near, off the post. Well, they were so close to the equaliser there. They're certainly a bit unlucky, but they need to make more of these chances. And showing a real will to win the ball. And they could face difficulties here. Gregoric, determined defending. And you need your defender to take charge. Well, you've got to say, comfortably off target, Stuart. Yeah, that's a waste of good possession. His teammates are not happy with him, and they're letting him know. Gregoric. Well, the visitors. Oh, wait a minute, Stewart. Look what's happening. Oh, it's a penalty in the opinion of the referee. And maybe they'll be able to level this up. An opportunity to level matters. Ball is loose. And the clearance over the byline means a corner. Over it comes, and well positioned to clear. Oh, that's a super piece of defending. Referee's whistle, that concludes. Away they go again. Second half is underway here. And Leipzig regaining possession. Promising attack this. Haidara. Well read to put an end to that attack. This man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Stuart. Well, Derek, he took his goal well and was a constant threat throughout that first half. I thought he showed a lot of skill to get out of tight situations and he had a real impact on the plate. And players waiting in the centre. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Well, the referee not too happy with the challenge and blows for a free kick. Grifo. And it's with Eggestein. And this is Grifo. Lukas Hörner getting into position to collect it. Looking for someone to play it to. That's effective pressure high up the pitch. Oh, yes, what a pass. Chance here. Is it going to be? Oh, what 
What on earth has happened? He's missed it, and what a glorious chance it was. Well, it's a bad miss. He really should score there. Lucas Hörner. And in the perfect position to read it. Aydara. Well, they could run onto it here. Interception to snuff out the danger. Well, that's common sense refereeing to play advantage. Openda. Plays it back. Oh, he couldn't outwit the keeper. Short corner it is. Aydara. Couldn't get it through. Leipzig pushing forward with options available. And quick thinking defensively. Ritsu Doan. Might be able to produce from this position. Well, all doing their bit to keep them out. Well, a joy to watch. Can he finish them off? And he struck the post. And problem solved for now. Well, that would certainly have wrapped up the victory. They're not quite home and dry just yet. Well, having been denied by the woodwork, now the focus is on keeping the opposition at bay. Intense pressure. Well, it was a promising avenue of attack, but the momentum has been halted. And you wouldn't be surprised to see the card handed out. That was a tremendous save after a wonderful free kick. A oh, very effective play, and they might be onto something. There will be one minute added on at the end. And that will be all for this game as the referee blows the... There wasn't much in it, to be honest. Really competitive game with chances at both ends, but they probably just about edged it overall and deserve the result in the end.
And the contest begins. And here's how Leipzig will line up. Well, if they're going to play as a 4-4-2, they must make sure they stay compact out of possession and then stretch the pitch when they do have the ball. How they play in transition is going to be key today. Oh, nice ball. And that'll be offside. Eintracht with the ball again. And the referee blows for a foul. Eki Tike. And options in the centre. Now they have possession in a good area of the pitch. He takes aim. Full marks to the keeper. Well, what a reaction from the goalkeeper. Such a good save in the end. He's driven in the corner. Not the most confident clearance. An interceptor there, and the post denied him. And he could be in proper trouble here. Terrific save. Well, the crowd are driving their team on here. They're surely going to score soon. Now well, the pressure from his opponent was telling. Nicely timed tackle. Paulsen. to like about that pass can he give them the advantage opportunity still there in it goes the goal for 1-0 and that changes the dynamic Skiri crossing opportunity and thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. Can someone get on the end of this? And that is not going to help the cause. The header well off the mark. And that was a very fine read. It's with Larson. Superbly read and executed. Brilliant piece of skill. Kunku. Super tackle and they've won possession. Well, he's certainly not alone. And by a wafer-thin margin, offside. Had a play for a Frankfurt throw in. Leipzig with the ball again. Promising pass. Making sure nothing untoward happened. Superb tackle. Well, inching towards half-time, and probably fair to say the fans were hoping for a little bit better than this. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, they've not had quite enough purpose to their attacking play so far. It's all been a bit too predictable. But in the second half, if they can get more support to their strikers and play with greater intensity, they can certainly turn this around. And the flag has gone up here, offside the decision. Dina Ebambe giving the ball to the opposition that time Openda decent position is it going to be? has to be there it is and he could scarcely have had an easier finish well, 
are underway once more and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in the second half strong but fair tackle Benjamin Henrichs and the attack looks promising good looking move and oh it's in we cannot declare this contest over they still believe Schlager oh a fine block under real pressure here oh surely well couldn't put it away couldn't square the game well that was a great opportunity they should really be level now Benjamin Henrichs. Icoma Luis Openda. Clean challenge. Elias Skiri. Hugo Ekitike. Oh, tremendous vision. In a decent position now. That's a good looking pass. Can he take the chance? Oh, a really crisp effort, but just wide. Skipping away. Paulsen. Well, good run and good ball control. And under pressure, that was a fine claim. Fine piece of pressure, can they capitalise on it? A superbly executed high press yet again. Hugo Ekitike. Fruitful looking attack. Marvellous anticipation. Well, the crowd are doing their bit. Can they find the equaliser here? Precise to shoot. And it wasn't taxing for the keeper. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. Hugo Ekitike. This is looking threatening. Paulson. Just the challenge that was required. Well, these fans are right behind the team here. Can they get the equaliser, though? Looking for the angle. And the defensive intervention there. Distributing it well. And that'll be a Leipzig throw-in. an ambitious pass didn't quite execute it properly well approaching full time and this is wearing the look of mission impossible for the home side Stuart well it's been a tight match but they haven't done quite enough going forward in my view it's all been a bit too predictable a lot of passing but not enough penetration they have to get crosses into the box in these final few minutes if they want to get anything out of this outrageously skillful Powerson. This could finish it! So one minute of stoppage time, that's what the officials have said. And the referee brings this contest to a close. It was a really tight game, but they were the better side over the 90 minutes and they fully deserved their victory today.
focus on this man the floodlights are shining down on the players here at the Borussia Park in the city of Mönchengladbach I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position and I'm joined for analysis by Stuart Robson and looking forward to bringing you action from the Bundesliga it's Borussia Mönchengladbach versus RB Leipzig can they convert and a goal they start as they mean to continue they make the opening statement Schlager. A very effective challenge put in. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. In position. Oh, marvellous save. Great goalkeeping. And that a play for a Leipzig throw in. Another perfect position to read it. Showing really good width here. And it might be. And that was goalkeeping right out of the top drawer. It's absolutely remarkable. His reflexes were brilliant there. Is this the moment? Oh, yes! You have to marvel at the sheer spectacle of it. Taking everyone by surprise. Yet at the same time, we know just how capable he is. A special moment. Opportunity. They had to react and did. And it's there for him. And he finds the net. He could hardly miss. The referee knew that was foul play, but advantage it is. Losing out, Weigel. Well, the defenders know they need to get tighter. Stopped a certain goal. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Did his job defensively. Gladbach couldn't retain possession. And nicely over the top. Oh, maybe the equaliser. He's trying to create something. Well, nothing productive, really. A move of promise on the flank. It should be. And a goal it is. They lead by two now. Fully deserved. Leipzig come away with it. Nice weight on the pass. Schlager. Aydara. Paulsen. 
real chance. And he thought of the attack with a masterful tackle. And the referee spotted the foul, but has played advantage. And threading it through. And there it is! Still life left in this game, and they have the momentum now. Well, it's fascinating. Leipzig still trailing, but this game is very much alive as a contest again. Oh, nice ball. Great block. A deft clearance. Incisive pass. Being egged on by the crowd. And it's gone in! The team's separated by two goals now. You cannot say they don't deserve it. And that is going to be all for the first. Well, as they get the ball rolling again, interesting to see how this second half pans out. Determined defending. Paulsen. And he clears the danger. He's given us away. Paulson. Honora. Well, can they be creative from here? Can't miss, surely. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. Well, using the space really well, you've got to say. But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Counter-attacking, very much an option. Ikoma Luis Openda. Really fine piece of defending play to break us up. That's a lovely ball. Doing everything possible to keep possession. Can he put it away? Oh, it's cheeky. Oh, that is a moment of pure quality. A goal for football lovers to enjoy the world over. And in the right position to read it. Well, making considerable progress with the ball. Can he get the level? An absolutely breathtaking spell. We were ready to write them off, but not anymore. All square now. Oh, doesn't get away with it. Free kick given. That's a very fine piece of tackling. Ball is loose. And a time for calm on the ball. Well, the stats back up what we've seen so far. Some good attacking football, chances for both teams, and plenty to enjoy. Let's hope for more of the same. Well, that'll be a free kick. That's a good ball. And coolly done despite the mounting pressure. Honora. Could be threatening. Well, time is of some concern. Can they level matters? Late drama here. Level once more. Incredible scenes. And he 
he read it well defensively. Can they push ahead in the closing stages? Can they forge ahead? No! Oh, he's given it! Penalty! And an opportunity now for them to jump in front. A goal! Accurate from the spot! Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. And the referee playing advantage. Paulson. Now, who can he pick out? Schlager. He's foiled them on his own. And there goes the final whistle. And the hut. Sometimes it takes a while to eventually get the better of the opposition, and that was the case here. They kept going, and they eventually got their reward.